fragrant sumac, Ruth chilabata. Let me show you an easy way to gather it. Just hold the basket underneath and sort of gently work the berries with my fingertips. And they'll just fall down in there. I can get a ton in a very short time. Best thing to do with these berries is to mash them up in water and let it soak for a little bit. And then drink that as like a kind of lemonade. The berries have a very nice sweet tart taste. You can also dry them to store and grind them up and make them uh, into that sumac aid. Sometimes I add them to my morning, morning smoothies or just eat them whole. Often you'll get some snails or some insects in there. Insects will walk out on their own. Their snails will just toss them out later. And it's fine to have leaves and their stems and stuff mixed in. And pop it in the oven and dry it and, um, and grind it up. It'll just kind of be part of your food. No harm. Mashing them up and making a drink is a great way to use the sumac fruits. Because it doesn't matter if you got some leaves or stems mixed in there. You just mash them up and you can strain it. And all the tartness comes out in the drink very easily. Pretty good mashed up there. Now it's only faintly colored, but it still has a very tart taste. I mean, it's already sweet, but if you add some sugar, it's basically like lemonade. Mm. It's very refreshing.